In this video, we will show you how you can fix iMessage activation error on your iPhone or iPad and get iMessage service working on your iOS device. iMessage is one of the most essential services of iPhone and it can be incredibly annoying when it stops working properly on your device. When iMessage is not working on your device, you will not be able to send or receive iMessage based text and your message bubbles will show up as green even if the person you are messaging to has an iPhone. Or you may even get an error that your message cannot be sent. Thankfully, fixing iMessage errors is easy and you can perform a number of steps to fix iMessage issues without much effort. The very first thing that you need to do in order to fix iMessage issues on your device is the most simple one. Just go to the messages section of the settings app and make sure iMessage feature is enabled. If you are running iOS 18 or later, you will have to go to apps section and then tap on messages from there. On the next screen, turn off the toggle for iMessage and after waiting a few seconds, turn it back on. If it was already turned off, just turn it on. This should refresh your iPhone's connection with the iMessage service and can potentially make it active once again. After making sure iMessage is enabled on your device, you need to restart your iPhone. To do this, hold the side button and volume down buttons together for a few seconds. And as soon as power off slider appears, swipe your finger on it to turn it off. Once the device has turned off, turn it back on. This should get the iMessage feature working on your device once again. More often than not, iMessage stops working due to server related issues with Apple's backend. iMessage activation errors can also be caused due to this issue. You can check if Apple is facing any ongoing issues that may be affecting iMessage service by visiting its server status page. We have shared the link to this page in the description of this video. The next thing that you should do to fix iMessage is to make sure you have an active internet connection. You can do this by switching between Wi-Fi and cellular internet and connecting to a different Wi-Fi network. Try opening a website in Safari and check if it loads or not. If the website loads, then internet is working fine on your device. Sign out from your Apple ID and then log back in. You can do this by going to the settings and tapping on your name from the top. Then on the next page, scroll down and tap on sign out option. After signing out, log back into your Apple ID and check if iMessage has started working again or not. A lot of times, iMessage stops working when your iPhone's date and time settings are incorrect. Make sure your device's time and date is correct by going to settings, general, and then going to date and time. To avoid any confusion, make sure you turn on the set automatically toggle so your iPhone sets the device's time automatically. If you haven't been able to fix iMessage and it is still not working, then make sure you're running the latest available version of iOS. You can check this by going to settings, general, software update, and there, if a new update is available, then make sure you download it and install it on your device, as doing so can fix iMessage not working issue on your device. If nothing else has worked, then you can try factory resetting your iPhone. Before you do this, make sure you create a backup of your device on your computer or iCloud, and then head over to the settings, general, transfer or reset iPhone, and then tap on erase all content and settings. After factory resetting your device, set it up again and restore your backup, and then try activating iMessage. There you have it. This is how you can fix iMessage not working on your device. If you found this video helpful, then please hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more iPhone tips.